Yeah, we're, we're looking for one more, one more this year. Many goals have been made this year by the Seattle Thunderbirds, but the main goal is yet to be achieved. A little bit of unfinished business from last year. Um, we, we came so close last year to, to winning it all, and um, it's kind of a second chance for us here, and um, I think we've got the team to do it. That's Jared Davidson, who plays center for the Thunderbirds. He still has hard feelings after last season when the team won the Western Conference, but ended up losing in the Western Hockey League Championship Series. It was devastating. Um, it, it's hard coming so close to, to one of your dreams and, and, and coming short. So um, this year, this year is really, really big for us. At least we get the chance to kind of do it again, and hopefully the uh, outcome's a little different. Despite only being 20 years old, Davidson is the veteran of this young team, made up of players 15 to 20 years old, coming from all over the world, hoping to eventually achieve their dreams of playing in the NHL. Davidson is from Edmonton, Canada, but says he's loved calling Kent his home the last five years. It's my second home. It's my home away from home. Um, everybody here has been super supportive and super uh, opening to me, kind of coming from, from Canada and not knowing a whole lot, and they've made it uh, super welcoming here. According to T-Bird officials, the five home playoff games at Excesso Showwear Center in Kent have been near sellouts with an average of 5,000 fans. Matt Odette, the head coach of the team, says that has been essential for their success in growing the sport. It's been a hockey town for a long time, and I think people are just starting to realize that and, um, you know, continue to grow the game here. Uh, it's a great, great sport, and, you know, I'm so happy that people are getting exposed to it. Odette says he believes their time is now. We're happy to be here, but we're not satisfied. We're looking to finish the job this year. The Thunderbirds' first game against the Winnipeg Ice will be this upcoming Friday. Meanwhile, the first home playoff game for the series will be next Tuesday right here at the Excesso Showwear Center. For now, in Kent, Brady Wakayama, King 5 News.